Many of our clients when embarking on RPA are faced with the challenge as to whether or not there should be a, a, an IT owned function or a business owned function. Our advice after seeing this deployed in both models is that a business owned function with the full support and the governance provided by the IT division is the most successful outcome. It ensures that focus is kept on the business benefits and also that the processes are developed in a way that suit the needs of the organization and are therefore agile and able to change. Um, but it does so in a way that ensures the information security uh, model is adhered to and that the risk is managed as it should be around any IT deployment. We have come across some cases where a client has decided to embark on this project without the help of IT. Uh, typically, whilst this might start the process off quicker and you'll see some quick wins in those early days, uh, we have seen that many organisations in the end bring this under the control of an IT organisation. And when that does happen, uh, typically there's a lot of rework and a lot of uh, um, changes to the implementation that then need to be undertaken. So our strong advice is to engage broadly across your business before setting out, making sure that we're addressing the needs of the IT stakeholders and we're managing those risks, uh, which are very real to businesses, um, but to deploy it in a way that really does achieve the benefits, of the, the, really achieve the objectives of the business and the business users.